Hello, Vinyl Community, and anyone else watching this. I'm going to make a video now. <laughs> I just finished making a video. I'm going to make another one. This one is um, another video that is long promised. And uh, a little while ago, um, Deadwax66 Randy made a video of his 10 inch collection. And that was followed suit by uh, Vinyl Richie, who also made a video of his 10 inch collection. And I want to do one as well. I'm going to include everything I have, including like some very old vintage records, which I'm going to show just very fast until we get into the quote unquote good stuff. But I've got quite a stack here. So um, without further ado, I'm just going to hop right into. This is my complete 10 inch collection, not counting 78s, although there is a 78 in here, but I'll explain that when I get to it. But I'm going to start off with just this kind of stuff. Jackie Gleason, Music to Make You Misty. Most of these I've gotten in thrift stores, very, very cheap. I'm not even going to show the backs of these, and I have two copies of this for some reason. Uh, Jackie Gleason, Tawny. Most of these I bought because they looked cool or were in really good shape. Like, this is just cool. Uh, songs by Tom Lehrer, 10 inch. That's just really cool. Oh, my camera just got really dark. This I showed once before. Xerox presents Take It From Here is a play. <laughs> it's really, really weird. And it has a Xerox machine on the back, which just is cool. Um, Jean Sabon Boulevardier, I can't pronounce that at all. Curtain Call with Marlena Dietrich, Libby Holman, George Jessel, and Ben Burney. Lena Horn Sings. Spike Jones plays the Charlton for, <laughs> Charleston for dancing. Yogi Jorgensen's family album. Again, who wouldn't want this? That's just cool. Elamay Morris with Big Dave and his orchestra. Barrel House Boogie and Blues. Glenn Miller, Glenn Miller plays selections from the film, The Glenn Miller Story. Earl Bostock and his alto sax. Phil Napoleon and his Memphis Five. I think this is where Ray Stevens came up with the Hen House Five Plus Two. It is from these people right here. That's what I think. Jeanette McDonald. And uh, the last one of these. This is the first one of these I ever owned. And this actually is really cool. I'm really glad I have this. Real Gone by Nellie Luchter. She is this just dynamite, like, solely blues singer. And this one is an import on Capitol Records. It's British. And um, picked it up a long time ago at a thrift store. And um, besides it falling apart a little bit, it's got the flip backs. It's just cool. This, I'm just showing because it's in a 10 inch cover. It's um, a Bobby Caldwell single. It's a heart shaped record. Uh, record looks just like it does on the. Uh, and the only reason I own it is because it's a red heart shaped record. Um, I don't even know if I've ever played it. Um, again, I got it at a thrift store a long time ago. Now we're getting into good stuff. In fact, this is a recent pickup. The same day I bought that 10645s, I bought this. This was 50 cents. Catch a Wave. This is British. It's a two EP set. I don't know if you'll be able to see what's on it. Um, all kinds of cool people on here. It is a gatefold. And that's funny because I wanted to make this video. And all of a sudden I find this. And I'm like, wow. 
This is really cool. It's got um, any of the Hot Rods, Radio Stars, Generation X, XTC, Blondie, Greg Kin, Ultravox, the Stukas, X-Ray Specs, the Radiators from Space, Johnny and the Self Abusers, Motorhead is on here, the Rubenus, Screwdriver, the Table, Little Bob Story, Earthquake, and Jonathan Richmond and the Modern Lovers are all on this thing. Pretty cool. I just picked this up, The Reds, and I mainly got it because they do a cover of The Doors, Break On Through, which I was very interested in hearing. And I think this one might be on colored vinyl. Nope, it is not. I am wrong. <laughs> I've known to be wrong. I've known to have been wrong before. Um, this one I think might have got showed by everybody that showed 10 inches. Nina Hagen, um, she does white punks on dope, which is why I would own this one. Aztec camera, forwards and backwards. It's a 10 inch, the cover is 12 inches high and 10 inches wide. It is a 10 inch. Um, in fact, it opens up and the record's right there. And uh, this has a dynamite live version of Van Halen's Jump on it. Worth it just for that. Awesome. Elvis Costello, the Clarksdale Sessions. What this is, is if you bought the deluxe version of the CD, this was everything on the second CD, which I've since got the album that has all of this on it as well. They put in a bonus disc. But this is the bonus disc stuff, including um, the the very awesome um, the monkey is on here, the old uh, Dave Bartholomew song, Elvis Costello, Ricky Lee Jones, Girl at Her Volcano. I've had this forever, and the reason I own this is again live. She does an awesome version of Walk Away, Renee. Squeeze, Heartbreaking World, with Tempted and By Your Side live on the B-side. Pretty cool thing. Gary U.S. Bonds, The Star. This is stuff, I believe, from his period between being famous and Springsteen. Um, Charlie put this out. I think it's a British import. Anyway. Dire Straits, so far away. I don't think there's anything special about this, really, except it's a 10 inch. The Police, Regatta the Blank, the whole album on two um, 10 inches, which is pretty cool. I haven't seen one of these in a long time. And that just reminded me of something that I definitely missed, that I have shown it before. The Magnetic Field, 69 Love Songs, the entire three compact disc set on um, six 10-inch records. Really cool thing to have if you're a Magnetic Fields fan. This is a must. It's not for everybody, but um, I really love this album a lot. But back down there. Paul Westerberg, the open season soundtrack. The only way on vinyl this was released is on a 10 inch. And um, it's got a couple of tracks not in the film and not on the CD on here, which makes it kind of cool. Cowboy Junkies, Blue Moon Revisited, Song for Elvis. This, I believe, is um, just like rarer stuff, b-sides or outtakes and covers and things like that. And this is in like, um, here's your set list. Um, it's in a poster basically. Um, I don't want to take too much time with any of these, but the whole sleeve is a poster. But it's not a poster that you'd hang because it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But 
Anyway, there you go. Cowboy junkies. Now I get to fold it up. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah, I think that's how it goes. I didn't have it folded up right the first time. That's how it's supposed to be. <laughs> Mitch Ryder and the Detroit Wheels. Wheels of Steel. Just sort of a greatest hits thing. Incognito Records Sampler. Um, I don't even remember where I got this from. <laughs> I don't know if I've played it or not. Um, I've had it a few years. But I think somebody threw it in maybe. I can't remember. Picture disc anyway. Which is kind of cool. Um, get out a little bit better. There's It's... Slide in the question marks earworks, by the way. <laughs> on Incognito Records. I didn't even know that much. I'm not sure I've ever played that. Again, I don't even remember how I got it. Joe Jackson looks sharp. Again, the whole album on two 10-inch records. I have a second one on a 45 box. <laughs> I used to love when they do that kind of stuff. It's a really cool thing to do. The gatefold had a pin that went right there originally. Long, long gone. Oh my gosh, I've been looking for this forever. <laughs> Two flexi this singles by a band called The Figs that I knew I stored somewhere. Well, found out where. <laughs> and there you go. The inside of the uh, Luke Sharp jacket. And um, I won't put those back in there. The police. Um, the do 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 da da da. The single on the badge. Promo only, not for sale. Don't stand so close to me. To do da 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 da. Wanda Jackson, town hall party. Um, there's a bunch of these town halls. Sound quality is very much lacking, but they're still kind of cool thing to have. Um, Town Hall was a TV special. This was recorded in 19... Actually, it was a program, not a special. From 1958, and this is directly off the television, which is why the sound quality isn't anything amazing. Capital Rarities, Wanda Jackson. Um, just a bunch of non-album tracks. Pretty cool thing. The legendary Jack Scott, of course, who did the original version of The Way I Walk, which um, Robert Gordon and Link Ray covered so successfully later. There's the set list on this. And, uh, yeah, some rockabilly there. A various artist called Guillotine. Um, Scott. All kinds of people on it. XTC comes with a little book. There's everybody on it. Not that you'll be able to see that, but XTC's on it. Roki Erickson is on it. Port in the Roots, X-ray, X-ray Specs is on it. Avant Gardner is on it. The Table, Penetration, and the Motors. So, fairly cool. 10 inch there. The Knack, live in Los Angeles, 1978. Not the best sound quality in the world, but still pretty cool. It's not terrible. Uh, my Sharona kind of rocks. Um, Stiv Bader's La La. The Last Year is a fantastic song on this. And he also covers the choir, It's Cold Outside, and a bunch of other stuff, but they're my two favorites, easily. Um, and this is on um, Bump Records, and it's on gray vinyl, and I'm not going to show you because it's in one of these things that's going to make a lot of noise if I take it out. The Motors, Love and Loneliness, this is only a single, but it is a 10-inch single, backed with Nightmare. 
course, Bram Tchaikovsky was in the motors. And um, it's on really interesting red vinyl with a very large label <laughs> on both sides. It has a very, very, very large label. And this is a British import. Reckless Eric, 10 inch on uh, Stiff Records. There's what's on that. And this is on gray vinyl, I believe. No, it's not. It's on brown, isn't it? Yeah, it's on um, sort of baby pool brown vinyl. Um, a couple of these other ones may have been on colored vinyl and I just didn't remember. But, uh, of course, Reckless Eric. Kind of discovered by Nick Lowe. Um, rushed into the studio when Nick Lowe heard the demo for A Whole Wide World. And, like, the record was out within two weeks of Nick hearing the demo. He loved it that much. The third Bardo, five years ahead of our time. Great garage rock here. Um, really cool thing to have. Um, Sundays put it out. I thought they did. Of course, a couple record store days ago, huh, two, three years ago, Ramones The Meltdown, um, 10 inch, um, which was originally a 7 inch EP in Britain. Everybody knows this, I think. On uh, blue vinyl, a little bit marbled. You won't be able to see anything in this darkness, but trust me, it's blue and it's marbled. <laughs> Get it back in this way. The replacements, another record store day object. Um, I had the original of this on. Um, it was a British import on uh, seven inch, but there it is on twelve inch. See the songs right there. Very cool. The Long Riders, looking for Lewis and Clark, the extended version with a few more songs on it. Love The Long Riders, just really good, rootsy rock and roll. The Knaves, Leave Me Alone, again on Sundays, more Great Garage. Speaking of Great Garage, not more on Sundays, the Del Vets. Another record store day, Big Star, Jesus Christ, the album version, the demo, and um, a bunch of other stuff. I love Big Star, I'll buy anything they put out, I'm just sort of a sucker. And I haven't opened this yet, because I got it after Christmas, so um, it's supposed to be on translucent blue vinyl. I'm not going to open it, I'm going to trust them. <laughs> Joey Ramone, Christmas Spirit, um, his solo version of Merry Christmas, I Don't Want to Fight Tonight, along with Christmas, Baby, Please Come Home, and some other stuff, I don't know, four record store days ago or something, and it's on red vinyl. Um, it's a pretty cool thing to have. What a Wonderful World is also on this, so... Again, pretty cool. Cheap Trick, Found All the Parts. Want to get Found All the Parts too, which came out last Record Store Day, but I haven't found it at a price I'm willing to pay yet. But just four outtakes, basically. I think two of them are live and two are outtakes. Nick Lowe and his band, Go Away Hound Dog, and I Changed My Wild Mind. This place is 78, <laughs> which... I just think it's so cool. They actually made a modern 78. Um, this is put out by Yep Rock. And um, I, just, I just think it's just kind of awesome. Marshall Crenshaw, I Don't See You Laughing Now. He's put out five or six of these. Maybe only four. I don't know, a bunch of them. Um, 
and um, covers always a cover on here. No time by um, um, yeah, the Idol Race is on here. Um, and there's always a live song too. The Ravenettes, Ode to L.A., and I'm So Lonesome I Could Cry, just a single, on um, white vinyl. The Kinks, Candy from Mr. Dandy, I showed this not that long ago. There you go. Straight out of Madrid, live at the Revolver Club. Danny Min, Chris Wilson, and James Farrell. Um, I'm a huge Flamin' Groovies fan, and I'll buy pretty much anything connected with the Flamin' Groovies, which of course Chris Wilson is. And um, I'm trying to think if they do any. Yeah, they do Shake Some Action, Slow Death. It's too dark to read it, but you won't be able to read it either. But. There you go. And I haven't gotten to this yet. I haven't had it that long. Another record store day. The Animals. Um, they're, I think, the second 10 inch they put out on record store day. Um, it's an oldie. Don't be fooled by the name, David Bowie. Um, this is an EP of some of his early stuff, six songs. And I don't know why they chose that for the cover. <laughs> I mean, this old stuff. Session 64, this came out a couple record store days ago. This is Brian Wilson producing some of the girl group stuff that he did. Kind of a cool thing. And uh, one more, Marshall Crenshaw, Move Now. Um, and um, Didn't Want to Have to Do It by The Love and Spoonful is the cover on this one. So, there you go. Another a little bit long video. <laughs> That's all of my 10 inches. Um, sorry I went through them so quick, but I had a lot. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe, all that kind of stuff. Hope everybody's doing well, I really do. Um, some of you I'm way behind on watching your videos, sorry about that. Um, the more there are, the more there are to watch. You know, the more you subscribe to and the more you guys subscribe to me, the more work I have to do. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, again, thanks for watching. Check out my podcast, snapcracklepop.podomatic.com, and I'll catch you next time. Um, till then, take care. Bye.